500 IQ squad ready for deployment. Guys, we just got a concrete evidence that Nuketown will be in Black Ops 4. I'm saying damn, because obviously we all thought that it's gonna happen, but obviously we never had any sort of confirmation or anything like that. But this time, this is coming from David Wandahar in a cryptic tweet that I will actually show you in just a little bit. Also, we have another information, and that information is coming from Alex Mason, voice actor, which is very, very hard. And I personally slept on that, and a lot of people are sleeping on this information and I will actually start this video by actually covering that it, it is a very very small information but then obviously we're gonna talk about Nuketown and I also do want to stress this enough that hey this year we're gonna go absolutely in with Black Ops 4 content so if you are new definitely do consider subscribing but this person or Alex Mason voice actor basically uh, said the following official Call of Duty Black Ops 4 power in number cinematic and he links the video I will actually have that no one gives a fuck about you. Damn! Playing in the background, but I won't be able to play that for too, too long because of copyright and everything like that. But he says, have anyone noticed my voice in the trailer? And at first I was like, whatever, whatever. But my man, KM, actually linked me. So big, big shout out to him. And then I actually watched it, listened to it. And yo, it is our boy, Alex Mason. And obviously, if you have watched this video, I will put a screenshot of, uh, of my thumbnail. Uh, in that video I was talking about that this game will have a campaign but it will be more of like a spec offs but in multiplayer that will have the specialist storyline and now basically we have a confirmation that Alex Mason is narrating that trailer but obviously we're going to have missions and this is the biggest thing that a lot of people just are sleeping on it a lot of people are very very quick to criticize Treyarch and basically they are not even verbally saying that we're gonna have like missions because obviously it's not really a big deal but for for some people that really think that campaign or no campaign is a big deal well obviously we're gonna have some missions so there is that but obviously it's not going to satisfy the majority but on the other side we got Adam who is a track employee and he says the following 10 years ago today I began work at Call of Duty studio on the verge of greatness at Treyarch has been or Trek has been my home since and together we've done some amazing things thanks to all of you who made this possible and thanks to David Wanahar for taking a chance on me on to Black Ops 4 and then David Wonderheart says the following remember that time you made Nuketown oh right remember the second and third basically saying second and third time and then and three dots I, I, I'm saying this but I get real naughty and a big big shout out to AK12 the Beast because he actually kind of like linked me or tagged me and I absolutely love the fact that you guys tagged me in information and I would absolutely love for you guys to just do that for any information that you see and I will be actually crediting all of you guys as well but this is really really fire because obviously we heard from David Wonderhar that Nuketown will be in Battle Royale and Battle Royale will be 15 times uh, bigger than Nuketown and Nuketown will be inside so obviously we knew it's coming but now it's basically also going to be a separate map which we all thought it's gonna happen but this is basically a confirmation so hey I'm just saying this but I get real real fire I wanted to actually live stream too but seems like I won't be or maybe I will who knows but uh, if you're new make sure to subscribe check out some other videos in the meantime and I will see you very freaking soon